Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this 10-sided uh, shape. As you can see in this uh, diagram, uh, such that its uh, horizontal length of one of its sides is uh, 20 units, whereas its vertical side uh, lengths are 21 and 9 units. Just keep in your mind that all these corner angles are 90 degrees. Now we are going to calculate the perimeter of uh, this uh, shape. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Now let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on the horizontal lengths of this shape. In other words, we are going to focus on these horizontal lengths, this one and this one as well. And for that reason, we have created these vertical lines as you can see and as a result we got uh, these uh, four rectangles now let's focus on this uh, side length of this uh, rectangle this is same as uh, this uh, side length likewise this uh, side length is same as uh, this uh, side length likewise this uh, side length uh, is same as this side length and finally this side length is same as this side length as well and now we can see this whole side length is 20 units so therefore all these four individual lengths add up to 20 units as well and now let's focus on this uh, horizontal uh, length uh, at the bottom as well this is uh, 20 units therefore our total horizontal length is going to be equal to 20 plus 20 is going to give us uh, 40 units and here's our next step let's go ahead and focus on the vertical uh, side lengths as well this one this uh, this this uh, and these vertical lengths for that reason we drew this uh, horizontal uh, line as you can see and now we can see in this rectangle uh, this uh, side length uh, is equal to this uh, side length and moreover in this rectangle uh, this uh, vertical uh, side length uh, equal to this uh, vertical side length as well now we know that this whole side length is 21 units so therefore some of these two lengths is going to be 21 units as well and moreover this whole vertical side length is 21 units as well so i'm gonna add 21 units more and we have created one more horizontal line in that result we got two rectangles as you can see over here now we can see in this rectangle this side length equal to this side length and for this rectangle this side length equal to this side length we know that this whole side length this one is nine units so that means the sum of these two line segments is going to be nine units as well and finally let's focus on this vertical side length this is nine units so therefore i am going to add nine units to it therefore our total vertical length is going to be simply 21 plus 21 plus 9 plus 9 if we add this thing that is going to give us 60 units so therefore the perimeter of this shape is going to be the total sum of these horizontal lengths and the vertical lengths so this is going to be the perimeter is going to be 40 plus 60 
equals to 100 units so thus the perimeter of this given shape turns out to be 100 units and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye